Welcome back everyone, Mean Pooh here, and today we are playing the game Nosha uh, or Noita, however you want to pronounce it. And it's a a roguelike game. Uh, you play a, a wizard character, you don't know if he's a man or a woman or a female or a male, if you want to call it that. And you explore in caverns and you have magical wands and different spells you can use. And it's an overall very interesting game. So let's jump in here and get to work. You also can levitate too. You get all kinds of hints. You know, if you're using a controller like I'm using, you can levitate, you can uh, sort of like kick. Let me show you, like that. And you can uh, switch your weapons by using the, I guess the little buttons at the top of the controller the corner buttons but anyway let's get in here now i must say i've had problems with the game earlier crashing every time uh, the game will restart it comes out of its environment and it decides to you know lock up but i'm hoping i fix this by setting the computer or streamlabs to capture the window instead of the exe and setting the game to window mode instead of full screen so we're going to see how this rolls and i see something we can use right here now i must warn you uh, this game it seems like it gets harder every time i play because these enemies get extremely um difficult on the fourth round or the fourth area they have sort of like red dot scopes uh with precision aim and there's no way you can get away from it even if you get a mod that lets you have uh, homing missiles or homing ammunition it, it doesn't do any good and even then it only says slight homing So we are going to see if it works. I'm hoping it works because this is like the, I don't know, eighth time I've streamed it. Today. <laughs> yeah, eighth time today. So right now I'm jumping in oil and what oil does is it makes makes you real slippery and also if you catch fire it's you will burn a whole lot faster you'll lose health so it's kind of hard for me to stop moving because of the oil on my feet and the only way you can get rid of oil is to jump in some water to wash it off Let's, I can move fast enough. Oh, I missed that gold. So that enemy is bleeding and it's bleeding acid. And I'm still covered and oil a little bit. Can't. This is gonna be close. Made it. But let me get some of this out because see, I'm still slipping. Alright, so we're clean now. We gotta re 
siege in and we replenish some of our weapons. Here you can buy different spells for your wand. Necromancy, I don't know what it does. It looks like it's the only thing. Yeah, I can buy this too. Spark bolt. Let's see what this does. Causes the corpses of creatures killed by the projectile to rise to your aid. I've never seen this one before. So we're gonna give it a try. And I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna install it in this wand here. Cause I have an extra space. And most of the time, well, every time when you make it out of this little labyrinth cave, there's an extra perk you can pick. Repelling cape, saving grace, and concentrated spells. I'm thinking we're gonna pick saving grace. I'm hoping it's useful. What? If you die and your HP is more than what? Hold on, let's read that. If you would die and have more than one HP, your HP is set to one instead. <sighs> See what I'm saying? That's pointless. But I guess it's better than nothing. I mean, hopefully you're at the end of the level because one HP is not going to do you any good. No. As, as you'll see. So you just explore. How's it going, Insanity Within? We're playing this early access game. Trying to get it in. And I'll tell you what's strange. These bees, or whatever they are. Hold on one second. One second. <laughs> but these bees, they bleed lava or something. And these little things right here, they have a mama or a daddy, but I call them a, it's a mama because it is like, um, it hatches eggs or whatever it is. And, uh, they just keep, uh, coming. She's just throwing eggs. Sometimes they're difficult to kill. Almost like a pest. Look, this whole place is on fire. Let me get this out of the way. It may, it may seem easy right now, but I tell you, it's difficulty is about to ramp up. Especially. When we get those enemies that have those red dot scopes. Can't let it take forever either. Okay. What is oh that's a part of the body. Okay, that's the way out right there. Alrighty. Eve online? No, I don't think I have played EVE Online. I think I might have had it in my download queue, but I don't think I've ever played it. 
Is it fun? I think one time I was looking like looking for uh, space games, and I think that came up. But I never, I don't think I ever installed it. Can't afford any of these. Pick an extra life. Pick more blood. You know, I'm not picking none of that. Blood. Now, see this oil blood thing? If you pick that, it makes you bleed faster when you're on fire and in oil. I mean, it's so random. I'm going to pick this extra life, and I'm hoping it's what it is. Okay. Now, this one says up on death, you respond with 100 hit points. So, that's an a real extra life so technically do i have two lives here very good space game i might have to get I, you know what I, I might have to get into that and try it because i think they had like a version of it for uh was it playstation playstation 3 i think thing do to me let's see what this does okay so it says formation behind your back cast two spells one ahead of and one behind then it says a crystal that explodes when someone comes nearby okay it's a deadly energy so did i launch it close to my to my body it didn't make sense. Let's try it again. So it's like a mine. Oh, oh, okay. All right. Huh. Oh, this, this is one dangerous weapon. One dangerous weapon. One dangerous weapon. One dangerous weapon. I do not like it at all. Let's get this one. What does this do? Let's read about it. Critical on oiled enemies. Double spell. Crystal that explodes when someone comes nearby. So it's limited in some points. Woo! Disintegration! Look at all that gold. Woo. It's been updated. Very good space game. Insanity Within, I'll try to get on it, man. I'll try that game out. Oh, God. Now, now the thing is, if you get shot by a bad guy, then your whole levitation gets drained that's why i couldn't move okay so here is the the moment of truth we're gonna start a new game and see if it crashes please don't crash okay looks like uh it loaded just fine yeah, I died, man. And this is not the only way you can go. You can also go a different way. Because, you know, it's procedurally generated, so it's going to be different every time. But I do know you can go to this side of the map. And I was exploring one time, and I, you know, went underwater and came up. And by the time I was done, I was pretty much half dead. But there was a tome or something over there. And I really don't know how to use it. See, it's over. It's over in here. But, you know, you can't breathe underwater. 
And the only way to get rid of some of this water is to blow holes in it. But you only have a limited supply of, of bombs, so you don't want to use it. This looks interesting. Maybe we should try to go in here. Look at that diameter. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I think we might have found something. What, a tree? Well, it's a good try. I thought we was going to get somewhere. All right, let's get on with our mission. Yeah, it's like every time you you die, then it creates a new level. But some of the things in, on the level still looks the same. Like, of course, these monuments here. And I think when we get into the cavern, there's usually a, a wand on the right side. And then there's one on the bottom. Those sort of like stay the same every time. But the enemies are different. I think there might be something, something over here that's pretty close. I do love the explosions. The explosions are something. I tell you, um, I got a video when I was streaming earlier today. The gun or the wand was so powerful that it, te it, it would teleport you and have all kinds of like kickback and like if you was in a tunnel the whole tunnel will be on fire all right okay. and there's other enemies with you know items like with dynamite and things like that that will kill you quickly. You can play this with a gamepad or you can play it with a mouse and keyboard. This is as far as we can go. There's a wand right there. Oh, no. And the thing is, how many do we have? But some of these are... Okay. 14 and 15. So I don't want to waste it. Some are not infinite. Okay, that's why you're on fire. There's a canister. I guess we can blow it up. Oh, it's an egg, and I don't even know what it does. Look at that. Look at it just like dripping through the ground. And it's mixing with their fire. Yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's in early access if you decide to look it up.
you see that worm thing? Oh, man. Lava to blood. Hmm, I don't know. Let's just get it anyway. And we'll see what they are. So. A slow but powerful orb of energy. And any lava within range of the projectile turns into blood. Uh, nothing for me. It doesn't do anything for me. But we can take this and put it inside of this wand here. Let's test it out see what it is. So what are we getting free today? Electricity immunity. More blood. An extra perk. Extra perk. Hmm. All right, let's see what happens if I pick this extra perk. From now on, you will find an extra perk in every, what? In every holy mountain. Every holy mountain? <sighs> I haven't even seen the first one yet. Hopefully I can find the holy mountain. Those enemies are around here somewhere, trust me. But I'm freaking out on that, uh, that big worm. No way, no way, no way I would do this in real life. The way out already? We didn't have to do much exploring. That kind of scared me there. I just left from here. Uh oh. Is this a, a fluke? I've never seen this before. Cause, because we just left. Good thing we had that uh, blue weapon. Seen nothing like that before. 
What is this? Never seen a store in the open either. I don't even have enough money. So I can't use it. Can't buy anything at the open market. Like there's another wand in here we can get. Okay, so we're gonna go up here and read what it does. Hopefully we can use it. Okay, and it's not that. 25, so it's just uh oh, hold on. It's just a wand that has ammunition that can be used up. This purple stuff that gets on you, it just makes it harder for you to move. And then the green stuff is a totally different story, it's just acid. Now this next stage, I'm definitely going to die. Let's see what that egg does. So, equip and throw. <laughs> That's all it does. Lava to well, any lava within range of the projectile turns into blood. Let's equip that and put it in this one. A tail of fire follows the projectile. Projectiles leave a trail of fiery particles. Okay, let's see. Now, if I shoot this, will the fire turn to blood as it goes across the screen? Breeze field. Breathless. Revenge explosion. Boomerang spells. Let's pick Boomerang Spell. Nice! <laughs> That's so not nice. So my weapons can kill me now. 
not even going towards their intended target. So it's almost if you pick anything and you think it's going to work for you, it's going to work against you in this game. It's going to work against you. Especially on this snow level. Oh man, this is going to be something. Got enemies with heat seekers. There's no sense of crime. We can blow a hole in the ground. Look at that mess. Oh, this was the perfect level. I had it. It's a curse. The perks are garbage. Don't do not <laughs> just know what perk you're picking. That's all I gotta say. Just know what perk you're picking. Now, who started that fire? Oh, I'm not going in there. Death trap. Definitely a death trap. So it looks like we fixed the crashing for now. I think these guys have shotguns. My mistake, dynamite. spilling out into the water. Knock me into next week. Can't afford, can't afford, can't afford. And we remember what I told you about these perks. Garbage. So, teleportitis. Let's, what is breathless? Let's pick that one. I've seen it a few times. Let's pick it. Hopefully, hopefully it has something to do with water. You won't drown with submerged. Actually, something that actually does what it says.
I got oil on my feet. so well. Yes! It's not crashing anymore. Capacity six. Worthless. Pretty much worthless wand. Might as well use it up. Oh, shoot. Kablooey. Fire starter. Just looks like fire. Shotgunner. He's not playing. He's not playing around. What happened? Can't move. Gosh. That was so suck. I want to get that, that wand. Just what I needed, a freaking squid billy. Instant death. Well, what I had to uh, make me die like that.
World's on fire. lava over there. So two exits. take this way out okay so this is actually called the holy mountain and all this one does is oh stay lit Lights your wand right up. This <laughs> pointless. Fireworks. I bet you that's exactly what it is. Fireworks. 
Let's put put that in this one and let's see what it does. No, not that one. Guess we're good. Critical hit. Extra life. Nice, we get something close. I know what we can do here. I need to put one of those blue orbs into my wand. Hopefully we can make it off this level. Woo! hoping I could put a dent in, in, inside of the wall so I can just climb up it.
Man, I really don't know what to get rid of. I mean, because this one is really, really good. Did we get rid of a one? Goodness, we were close to get. Thank goodness. Wow, look at this thing. Okay, let's let's do this. Let's take. some of these and put it in this that and that and another one out here make the bolt there. Let's see what that does. Okay, now we can get rid of this one. Get rid of this main one here. What does it do? A slow orb of void that eats through obstacles. So we got two black holes, some fire, particles, spread, black hole, black hole, black hole. Okay. So we have bought that. Explosion immunity, invincibility, and faster movement. go. Like I said, this level is it's darn near impossible. I don't even know how to get past it. Thank you. 
stuck on the wall. But this one's not going to be a long run. just bad. Thanks, PUBG. PUBG says, just dropping something. Gotta go. Great stream as always. Appreciate it, man. It's always good to see you. Poison. Much appreciated, my brother. I was playing this game earlier, man. I mean, if you're still in here, uh, it kept, just kept crashing and crashing every time you start a new game. And it's, you know, it's early access. But every time you start a new game, it would just crash. But I think I fixed it. I just set everything to window instead of full screen, and it works perfect. Hey, PUBG, is there any game you would like to see, man? We might make it to the bottom. We might make it to the exit. Woohoo! Yep, we made it with 18 health. The impossible game.
What is this? Fire arc? Oil. Let's get the energy spear and see what it does. So we can take that and put it in here. Better than nothing. Better than nothing. So we need to look out for some blood. We get some health. Look at that! It's floating to the top. Isn't that weird? This whole game is weird. Looks like we're stuck in here. But, you know what we can do? Watch this. Blow a hole in this place. I like a dead end over that way. Oh, is it a dead end over here? Oh, it's fire over here. Okay, move on. Every time I pick extra life, it doesn't work. Level. Look at these heat seekers, man. It don't make any sense. Look at that. Oh my god. Oh my god. No. Well, I think that about does it. <laughs> I've tried so many times to get past that level, I cannot get past it. Well, once again, for the 10th time, thanks for watching today. Sorry about the difficulties we've had. And I'll catch you next time. And by the way, there are some free games on Steam. Destiny went free, so you might want to try that one too.
All right, this game has been Noita. Uh, it's um, one of those roguelike games again, and it's in early access. It's kind of easy at first, and I'm meaning like the first level, and then it gets very difficult. And as you've seen on that level there, it's almost impossible. But uh, I'll catch you next time. Mean Poo out.